adjusted to my driving profile. And how many are there? Is there one or two? Well, you can set it up in any way you want. No, I mean, like, how many how many different profiles can you set up? Oh, I don't know. Uh, probably probably at least a couple. or so, okay. Probably half a dozen. That's sick. And you just go into the, the main car setting just to change the profiles? Yeah, right. Uh, quick controls. Mirrors, steering wheel, in, out, whatever. And then you give it, you give it a name. And then when you get ready to... When I take my seatbelt off... Oh, so there's valet mode. It, 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 it puts me so I can easy access yeah, in right. and out. Right. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, it, it also has uh, valet mode. What is that? You just it makes it super wide? Or that, that limits the speed? That limits the speed. Oh, okay. And all the, you know, they can't put it in the, uh, for example, they can't put it into... Uh, they can't change anything. The sport much, mode. Right? So, and, before, and but to take that off, you have to put like a code in or... It yeah, turns... a four-digit code. Gotcha. Yeah. Okay. I usually drive around the city in the chill mode, but if I'm going to go on the freeway, right. I put it in the spot. Uh, so anyway, touch the brake, put your foot on the brake, and uh, it's going to my profile. Okay. And uh, off we go. I, I put it in the sport mode because we'll... <laughs> What does this do? 2.9? Or is it quicker than that? This is 3.5 oh, okay. is the marketing. But if you've got a full charge, it'll do it in 3.2. 3.2? Yeah. This is so cool. But, but just, you know, tapping. <laughs> oh my god! That wasn't even nothing. Oh wow, that's amazing. You can give yourself a whiplash. It's insane. From dead start punching it, it makes me uncomfortable. Right. Uh, <laughs> I, I, you know, uh, I, I try not to do that. Right. But a lot of guys, you know, they do the fleet stop. You'll get a hold and it'll go into hold and it's the same as putting, you know, your parking brake on or emergency brake on. Oh my god. Let me turn off the noise here. That shows the cars. Look at that. It's like we're in GTA 5. It knows exactly where the cars are. That is flipping ridiculous. Watch when this car turns. Right here. And then you can see it's tracking the car. That is now version nine. Lipping and really <laughs> Now I'm oh. not touching the uh, brake. Right. We're just doing the regenerative. Part. All right. There we go. <laughs> oh, that was amazing. Oh. God, that thing's zippy. And it has torque range up the Yezu compared to a gas. Like, right now, yeah, look at that. That Oh, my gosh, the torque is insane at 60. What, what? The set limit function, that's like, you don't want it to go lower than that? No, if you want to, I don't, I don't want it to charge above 90%. Oh, okay, gotcha. So, uh, now I can move, I can slide this back and forth. So in case like this, you're at the last charging station, you might move it to 100 occasionally? Yeah, if, if I'm on a long trip, I'll move it to 100%. And what and what's your charging experience with this? Like, what's the lowest? How low have you ever run this thing, percentage-wise? Yeah, I came back from San Francisco the other day, and, and I got it, it when I got up to Donner Pass. Uh, it was fourteen uh, percent. And how long did you plug it in? I left Vacaville with ninety percent charge. 
Right, but I mean, like, when you came back with 14%, when you plugged it in, like, approximately how long did it take to get to 90%? I didn't charge it to 90, I charged it to 80. What I did was I stopped in, uh, uh, I stopped in Truckee, and behind the Safeway... There's, yeah, there's a charging station there. Yeah, there, there's 11 uh, uh, charging stations. And, uh, and also the battery warned me because it was below it was below freezing when I got to uh, Donner Pass, right? And uh, and because I was down below twenty percent, uh, it, it it noted there's our cars. That is insane! Look at that! It shows exactly but, where the cars are. But version nine shows everything. Right. It, it'll if there's a motorcycle, it'll show a motorcycle. If there's a, if there's a person walking across, it'll show. And are these cars supposed to be Teslas? No, these are... They're, well, I mean, like, the on here. They almost look like they're like, hey, look, the rest of the cars are supposed to be Teslas. You right. know how Elon does his marketing. Right, but version 9, which I'm waiting for the upgrade, Right. it's coming any day now, will show trucks and cars and people and motorcycles. When uh, is that supposed to come out? It's, it's, it's being rolled out now. Oh, okay. So, so pedestrians, motorcycles, trucks, and cars. Right. Wow. And are they ever going to do bicycles? I, I bet it. Wait, what do you think it'll show up as a, a pedestrian, probably? Uh, maybe as a motorcycle. Or a motorcycle. We're, 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 we just change lane. Automatically. Yeah, I just pushed the lane. Wow, it just changed the lane for you. Yeah. Wow. And it'll. It, so, like, if you do it, like. And I'm, I'm changing back. And it won't do it if there's a car. That's right. What the f It looks around. It's got those 12 sensors. In what is going on? It's got the cameras. That is insane. Oh my and gosh. it does stop and go traffic. It's beautiful. Right. Just 